Can I take your order? What's good with y'all, man? It's your boy Leaky Filmy coming at y'all with another reaction video, man. Now look, 7 p.m. Central Time, daily uploads, bro. You already know what time it is, bro. If you're not here on time, bro. Uh, do I even gotta say any more? I don't think so. But I uh, appreciate the support nonetheless. Look, bro. Leave a like on this video. Comment on this video. It'll help your boy. It'll help your boy videos get pushed. You feel me? If you're a real supporter, that'll really help me out. You ain't even got to say much in the comments, but I really appreciate it. But look, bro, this video is called 20 Inappropriate Moments in Live Sports. I told y'all we're going to be switching it up, you know, doing different type of videos, things of that nature. You know, you already know what time it is. So let's get into the video, man. I got my Burger King headset, right? Let's get the video cooking, man. <laughs> Welcome to Cooper, and here are 20 most inappropriate moments in sports shows on TV. But before we begin, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, subscribe and turn on notifications for the next videos. All right, let's begin. Broadcaster Jason Witten had a day to forget at the 2019 Pro Bowl. He accidentally broke the trophy when trying to lift it up. Oh! There you go. Get it down below. There we go. Here we go. You got it? There you go. You guys got it? There we go. Female MMA fighter Maricela Cornejo was dressed inappropriately during her weigh-in. Shit, I know she's just trying to look good for your boy. She knew I was going to watch this video. What's her name? Marcela Andelejo. That's her name, right? Hold on, let me see. Female MMA fighter Maricela Cornejo was... Maricela Cornejo, she, she, she wanted me to see this video, bro. It's clearly obvious, my nigga. I'm not being delusional. She literally wants me to see this video so I can DM her, bro. Because y'all know what type of time I get on. If it looks good, I have to DM it. I'm not going to lie to you. She knew I was going to be watching some a video of this nature. And she was like, I know Leek's watching. Let me let me put on my best fit. Let me be on my best behavior type shit. So, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be in them DMs. I'm going to be in them DMs. Appropriately during her way in. But I am kind of scared, though. Look, look, I am blabbering. She is a good looking lady, you know. But she is an MMA fighter, my nigga. If you thought things could get abusive, my nigga, put it to the fifth power, my nigga. Imagine, imagine you come home, she mad, and then she put your ass in the arm bar, bro. What are you going to do, my nigga? You have to shoot, my nigga. That's the only answer, bro, because you're not going to be there in the fight. She, she's used to taking licks. Like, you're not going to just piece up, bro. Like, no. That's kind of scary. I don't know. I kind of be scared of dating. I don't know. Nigga might choke a nigga out or some shit. I don't know, bro. I don't know. But I'm still going to be in them DMs, though. Yeah, she look good. She know she look good. Jeez. 66.6. 66.6 what? Kilogram? To the back. Yeah. About inappropriate moments. University of New Mexico junior defender Elizabeth Lambert has been suspended indefinitely from the women's soccer team after her rough play during a match against BYU. Damn, nigga! Look, shorty, look, short, look at shorty face right here. She's smiling. She don't even know this shit coming, bro. She literally just gave her a fucking yank, bro. She yanked the shit out of her, bro. Damn, chill. What the? I gotta see what I gotta see that one more time, bro. The back. This is crazy work. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. University of New Mexico junior defender Elizabeth Look, Lambert has punched been Shorty in the back. She like, oh fuck, and then the next one got the worst after of it. After her rough play during a match. Damn, nigga, bro, all you see is look, nigga, legs in the air, my nigga. No, nah, put her ass in an insane asylum, bro. How the fuck you grab somebody by the hair, bro, and next thing you know, before they hit the ground, nigga, they legs is in the air, my nigga. She is a menace to society, bro. They need to lock her up and fucking swallow the key, bro. And whoever swallow the key, bury him six feet, bro, because she probably go get the fucking key. Escape jail and get the key, and then go back into the cell or some weird shit, bro. I ain't gonna... Man, she gotta be watched, bro. That's crazy. What the fuck, dude? Look at Look, she's cooked! Fucking finish and move, nigga. Like, you just hurt that young lady's back, bro. This actually happened at gymnasium during the 25th annual World Gymnastics Championship. 
a springboard breaks during a jump and causes the man to fly 40 meters and crash. God damn, this nigga turned into fucking Rob Van Dam. Fucking frog splash, bro. What the? I ain't gonna lie, bro. I thought that nigga was finna do a swanton at first, bro. The World Gymnastics Championship. A springboard breaks during a jump and causes the man to fly 40 meters and crash. Bro, that's fucking Rob Van Dam, bro. That nigga's a professional wrestler, bro. I already know he is. And he got up like it was just fine. Yeah, yeah, that nigga, yeah. Go ahead, enjoy the WWE, buddy. The official tools of gymnastics. Ali Albert suffered a wardrobe malfunction during the Legends Football League game. She wanted some kind of penalty called on the opposition. Whoa, whoa, whoa! She let the ref have it. Now, now what am I gonna do now? Okay, what, do you, what do you want? What do you want? I called? want a penalty because you keep calling penalties on us. If there's a holding on the inside here, that's gonna be really tough to call. Okay? Because you see my chest? I'm not looking at one. Look, look, nigga, nigga, trying to keep it together, trying to keep it professional. Look, I'm not. No, no, she's steady pointing and shit. He like, ma'am, ma'am, my eyes are up here. They're up here. Nigga, she pressing that nigga, bro. Do they still have This leads? female boxer stunned her opponent by kissing her on the lips as they faced off before a fight and got a slap for her troubles. What the fuck? Freaky ass fighters, bro. A kiss is crazy, bro. Nigga, do you want a fighter or do you want a fighter? Yeah, the fuck out At the Player of the Year Awards, Didier Drogba and his friends from Chelsea go behind the reporter and imitate her. Players who wear the blue of Chelsea, who wins? Well, that is up to you. Now, last season, Didier Drogba walked away with the top award. The big question is, can he do it again? Well, in around half an hour from now, we'll be finding out. Sport journalist Rachel Nichols was seen low-key flirting with LeBron James behind the scenes. <laughs> look at the, look, bro, Rachel Nichols gotta be stopped, bro. She got to be stopped, bro. They, she got the Jimmy Butler allegations. Now that they talking about she flirting with LeBron, bro. This is this is during the bubble. Oh, yeah, she was on menace mode. I'm not going to lie to you. Because the Jimmy Butler shit with Rachel Nichols, it happened during the bubble, right? My nigga, this is during the bubble. So she went from Jimmy Butler trying to get King James, my nigga. Trying to get King James. Nigga, next she need to get leak, my nigga. Because Rachel Nichols, my baby, I'm not going to lie. You're a wonderful looking woman. Wonderful. I will treat you nice. Take your ass right to McDonald's. Anything from the dollar menu, my baby. I'm just that type of guy. You feel me? I'm next. Shit, like, well, I can't get flirted with. Sprinklers went off during a football match, and a few of them took the chance to cool down a bit. Talking about inappropriate moments. How is this inappropriate? I mean, it wasn't supposed to happen, but... I ain't gonna lie, I probably would've just stood in the middle of it, I ain't gonna lie. Goalkeeper Gunnar Nielsen decided to approach Sladen Ibrahimovic, but before he could say anything, the Swedish striker casually threw the ball at his face without looking. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Oh, wait, wait, before we get into the WWE, cause bro, I love them, I love them divas, bro. But look, bro, these niggas that play football or soccer, whatever you wanna call it, bro, cause I know people be getting upset when you call it soccer and shit. But look, bro. Goalkeeper Gunnar Nielsen decided to approach Sladen Ibrahimovic. Bro, these niggas be crying, bro. Oh my God, he just threw the ball, what the? Bro, these niggas be, bro, NBA niggas be crying, bro, but these niggas be crying, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. But before he could say anything, the Swedish striker casually threw the ball at his face without looking. I really don't know who cries more. One fan wanted a bit more than a high five. He grabbed Nikki and gave her a kiss on her cheek. No, nah, that nigga, no, that nigga not slick, bro. That nigga, who was that? Nikki, Nikki James or whatever. That's that WWE girl, right? Nikki James. 
No, that nigga. Look at that nigga. That nigga said he was getting his regardless. That's crazy work. That's crazy work on live TV, my nigga. That's crazy work. That nigga said I'm getting a piece of this no, no matter what. Let me see that again. Gave her a kiss on her cheek. No, that's crazy work, bro. No, that ain't Nikki James. A BBC reporter accidentally fell into a swimming pool. A what? A, a who? Wait. A BBC reporter. A BBC reporter. My nigga, I'm not in the video and I'm not a reporter. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm too. Accidentally fell into a swimming pool during a hilarious live interview with the British swim team. Connor. Did that nigga drown? James Guy. Congratulations. The step. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Nigga trying to be cool in front of the shorties, bro. Come on. Inconsolable there. Just look before you get in a swim pool in future, okay? I hope you can still hear me. I'm gonna have to get rather close and mind the step. <laughs> can you continue, Sarah? Because we want to talk about your guy. You don't want to talk about me falling in the water. <laughs> Wait, so everyone's all the people watching here are literally on the floor. But you gotta, you gotta. Check out Pistons rookie Brandon Knight as he leaps out of bounds to try and save the ball and crashes into the sideline. And gets doused in Gatorade. I thought he may have saved, and let's see if everybody's okay. See, nah, Brad and Knight gonna forever be known for missing that game when they left and getting cooked by Kyrie. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. This has to be the funniest moment of the World Cup 2018. Michi Batshuayi celebrating his goal by thumping the ball as hard as he can. Ooh. Just a shame he hits the post and it hits him in the face. This nigga acting like he dying and shit. Manchester City star Alexander Zinchenko celebrated his country's 5 to 10 demolition of Serbia by planting a kiss directly on the cheek of sports reporter live on television. Well, I look like Shorty Loki was fucked. She was rocking with him. Look. Look. This diver, Noemi Batke, was trained so hard for this competition to show her swimming skills, but the cameraman also showing his skills to make the competition look more interesting. Let me see. The nigga think he's slick, bro. Nigga think he's slick. His ass trying to go from the bottom up and show a little bit of cheeks on the way. This nigga think he's slick, bro. These cameramen, bro. When Cristiano Ronaldo troll face with Juventus reporter. Altre tante partite sarebbe un inizio migliore possibile, immaginabile. Affronta una formazione. That's not that's not even really inappropriate. He's just having fun. I feel like people do this a lot. Sono della trasferta di Parma e attende i sorteggi di Champions League. Ronaldo, that's crazy. I know who Ronaldo Instead is. I feel like everybody knows Ronaldo. Tommy has just tried distracting Roger Federer and he won. I've never watched a single, a single soccer football match. I've never watched one. This cute tennis player couldn't stop laughing at opposite player's mistake. No, nah, I'm a laugh in your face. I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah, that, that's that type of guy. I am. I'm gonna laugh in your face, bro. It's gonna be all right, I'm laughing with you, not at you, bro. Jack Sock was the butt of all jokes after his loss to Roger Federer after managing to unsettle the Swiss legend with his backside. A large glutus maximus. All right, at the glutus maximus. Look at these niggas. Glutus maximus. Hey, come on, dog. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. Thank you for watching. Come Hope on, dog. Drink. Niggas freaky, bro. That's what y'all doing in tennis, bro? Come on, bro. That's why I watch Serena Williams and them. Them, them the only people I know. And them Naomi girl. Because y'all, what is it? What are y'all doing, bro? Well, I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And what I'm going to do, catch you in the next video. Bye.